Is that gold? <laughs> Look. My friends Gus and Nina bought a hoarder house that had been sealed for almost 20 years. They called me in to help separate the trash from the treasure. You're not gonna believe what Gus found in the basement. This whole house is insane. This whole experience is insane. Wait. All right. Gus has assured me that everything's for sale, Jocelyn. Everything. Okay. All right. What else do we want to buy today? You know what I would love to get to is that vase right there. Every time I walk in that room, my eye goes straight to that vase. And also the penguin. It's like vase, penguin creeper. Creeper penguin. Looks like there's also some little um, Madame Alexander dolls. I'm curious about those. This is terrifying. That's going across the floor. Okay. What do we have over here? What is this? This is a morphic lamp. I've got this thing. Let's see if we can get around the side of the table. Hopefully nothing attacks us. This is chalet. I noticed that the other day. Unfortunately, it is broken. Um, right here, one of the pearls is broken on that. This thing is awesome. I believe it's Italy. I'm pretty sure that's Italy. Let's stick it in this box. This rat freaked me out the first time I saw it. I'm not going to lie. This feels nice. I should pull that out. We should pull this out. It feels nice. What do you think it is? Oh, it looks like glass. All right, so we've got the most amazing stopper in the land. It's one of the items. This feels like a vase. Oh, it's a raccoon vase. You know what? I might set you guys up over here. Ooh. Sign on the bottom, Brian or Brian. That is some piece. I like that a lot. This. This is Morano. Oh, I love you. You're my friend. What is this? It's like Christmas unwrapping all of this stuff, for real. What's in there? I don't recognize the mark on the bottom. Yeah, there's... This. I only see the one seat hole in there. Yeah. The other one. Oh, it's that hole. And that one's not marked by our He is ceramic and marked on the bottom. I thought he was new plastic. 
All right, well, I want to keep looking over here because I really, really, really want to find the decanter that goes with that stopper we just uncovered. Like, I'm determined. It has to be here somewhere, right? It makes sense. Wait. That can't be it. That's too light. That's too light and fluffy. The decanter is going to be big and heavy and substantial. Oh, there's my big light. Big light. Oh, wow, well, look, it's got Melifiore. That's a beautiful piece of big light. Wish there was another one down here somewhere. Not really seeing much, though. All right, well, let's climb back there again and see if we can find the decanter. It has to be back here somewhere. Is that gold? Ha! Look! 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 Look, look, look! That is gold. That is gold. Right there. That's a gold chain! That's too funny. I'm gonna take that out and show this. Put everything back in there and make him look for it. where my eye went. <laughs> I just pulled it out and I put everything back in there so you could find it. Hey, read this. this is... Well, I don't know. Oh, wait. Some fancy keys on there. Well, let's see here. I think that purse back there is Whiting and Davis. I don't know why I haven't just grabbed it yet because I'm, I'm actually like, it's pretty rough. It's not. Yeah. It is Whiting and Davis, but it's pretty toasty. All right, well, what I did notice when I pulled that out was that there's something behind there that looks like a bottle or it could be a decanter so maybe this is it there it is something just fell what was it what is this the teapot fell over what is this A nice piece that would have had a cocktail stir, probably. So that's here, my smoky glass. I don't think there's anything left in there. It's pretty good. Nice. What is this? Raymore Roseville. That's black, though. The, the stuff we've been finding is primarily brown. Eric says that this is a good, a good Roseville, though. Um, let's look. And some oh, this one. It's a teapot. Maybe not. I'm curious what's in this bag that's all wrapped up and really tall. There's a pair of a there. Look at this tile. What is that? Are you ready? This tile. That's amazing. I like that. It's even got like a copper around it. That's bougie. Who's your copper? What is this thing? This is weird. Okay, let's bring this outside. All right, well, Andrew is packing up all of our stuff. I noticed that pink thing that I missed before. And all of you were probably screaming at me. 
The pink fish, the pink fish. I'm sorry, I missed the pink fish. I don't know how. I'll see it now. What is that? That's crazy. It's got a boo boo there on my man. That fish is crazy. Crazy enough that I like it. Alright. That's fun and funky. Got a little atomic lines on that, baby. Alright, so we're gonna start adding. <laughs> we're gonna add some more to a pile. Okay. I'm curious, what is in these boxes? And we must get to them. Don't know how we're going to do it, but we must. Right, I'm going in. I'm gonna put my foot right over here. I'm gonna put our other foot right here. Ooh, look at those plates behind the door. Those are great. Haha. -ha. Aren't you glad we did that? Look at that perfume bottle. That's amazing. What else do we have here? Little marks. That looks like marks. Let's see. That's so cute. And then that's made in Japan. That is not marks. <laughs> What is this furry thing? It looks like a creature. Oh my god. Oh my lord. That is terrifying. I don't even want to... Oh, gross. These are really cool. You know what? Maybe I'll add those. I like those. Oh, I'm going to the window side. This can go in the window sill. I've got, now I've got fur all over my hands, and it wasn't even a real animal. This is my way. That is so cool. There's a box underneath. Let's get to it. Let's just move this box. There it is. There is the money right there. Look at that. That's it. Right there. Pull it up. Ready? Oh my goodness. Is that Lane? That's amazing. Kitty cats. All right, so I'm feeling a little bit of a time crunch because Andrew's almost done packing. We gotta get out of here. And I've just discovered this little treasure corner and I'm like, I wanna make sure that I see it all before we leave today. I mean, all of this stuff that's, you know, been here. This looks like Russell Wright. This is a Russell Wright picture. That stuff unfortunately chips super easily. This is the one we went through with the dog. Um, I think we went through these. We didn't really go through this one, so you know what? let's do this. You're back! I'm back! That's a really nice Volacante smoky piece. Uh oh, oh, that wasn't good. Eek. Hopefully, nothing got broken. What is this? Oh, is this one of the tiles you've been looking for? No, no, okay. It's not a belly. Well, it's not one of the ones that we have. It's good. It's a different chunk on it. Is that schmutz on it? A little schmutz and it does have a chip. Unfortunately, unfortunately, this one does have a crack. If I'm ignoring that, what is that? That is crazy.
this to a file. I like her. Oh, she's gold. Great. I don't think they're gold. I don't think they're gold, but it looks gold. Like, even her fingers, the detail they took to, like, you know, make yeah. her fingers. Yeah. That's Indonesian, I think. Oh, she's fantastic. I just, I don't... I don't know. I love it, but the, in my what head... Is it? What is it? I don't it? know, but in my head, I'm like, I would buy it, but then I'm like, can I get rid of the smell? Do you know what I'm saying? Mm. Yes. I'm so torn on the fabrics. I, I, under, I understand. I under, I'm so torn yeah. on the fabrics. Okay. This box was the last box I was going to pick through. Yeah, there's some really neat pieces in here. I need all of the lab stuff. All of the lab stuff. <laughs> I'm <laughs> um, What is that? Down there. What is it? It's a vase. It's a vase. It is. Please be careful. Don't hurt anything. Oh, look at it. Yes! And <laughs> made in Finland. Look at that beautiful piece. Okay, we gotta dig through this box now. I thought this box was all just regular glass. Now, we're on to something. What is this? That thing is crazy. Wowzers. That's the stopper to something for sure. All studded out. I see it. Okay, I'm gonna go get rid of. I have stuff under my armpits. You guys know how I roll. I'm gonna go get rid of this, then we'll dig through this box, and then we're gonna get going. Is it crazy that I feel like after I've accomplished this box, I feel like I've I've looked through everything? Like this is the last piece of the puzzle. That's how I feel right now. Where are you going, spider? Or that way? Please go away, spider. Don't bother me. Right. These little brass shoes. This one is Larry. 47. It's a shame that those little, I'm sorry, copper shoes, I don't know why I said brass. Let's see if it's in here. That's beautiful. That doesn't say. No, it was in here. That's why I'm like, I have to go through this box before I leave. Yeah, I, I uh, actually, when Nina was here with Jessica, she packed this box. I haven't looked in it yet. Um, put it to the side, man. It's not going to go anywhere. It'll wait for you. I love it. It's signed. Okay. It's signed. I don't know. 90. <laughs> 1990. Vintage. Uh, vintage nice, a nice vintage. That's years. It's vintage. Anything other than 20. All right. I have rifled through the box. I pulled out these pieces. This piece is stunning. It's kind of a scavo texture. Beautiful, beautiful vase or vase pitcher. Until I'm operating on very little sleep. Also, this aluminum medallion, Faro made in the USA. I like it because of this added uh, eye slip detail. I think that's really nice. So. Um, Gus just pulled a beautiful McCoy piece out of here. He's going to take that home and use that to grow his plants. And then I think that's it for us. Okay, well that concludes our adventure for now at the Treasure House. That was amazing. That was an outstanding experience. Andrew, did you have a good time? Yes. Yes. I cannot wait to come back and we will be back. We have already started making plans to come back within the next two weeks and uh, do a little bit more digging, possibly upstairs. I feel like we've got some really great stuff. We've got the whole Camaro loaded down the next time, thinking we're gonna have to bring a van. Hey, I still got- And an Eric. I still got, let's see, I got five large, extra large bankers boxes just in the trunk, plus yeah. all my stuff that I had in my trunk. Yes. Yes. And we've got another six boxes in the back seat right now, and then I'll get the luggage in there. So and he's gonna get the luggage. He's gonna fit it all. Yep. He's gonna it'll fit all it all. Fit. Um, so it's just it's.
crazy. It's crazy. And we're going to come back. We're going to bring Eric with us. He's going to go through some stuff as well. Um, and uh, it's it's insane. What did we end up totaling? $1,700. $1,700 for all of the stuff that we bought from Gus. Um, that includes all the stuff you saw throughout the video. The total being 1700 thus far. Um, and of course, as always in all of our business transactions, if we end up doing exceedingly well, we will come back to Gus with more money. But um, I'm really thrilled with everything that we got. So, so excited. Um, now I am going to mention that Gus and Nina, um, who you briefly saw Nina, they are starting a channel together and uh, they have been documenting this entire, entire adventure from the very beginning when the house was packed full. Uh, we're gonna end the video here and uh, we'll pick this adventure up in a week or so. All right, see you guys tomorrow. Thanks for watching and I hope you enjoyed this video. In case you spotted something you just can't live without, we do post 25 to 30 new items in our eBay shop every single day and I've posted a link to that down in the description.